in jug face, Ada is a rambunctious troublemaker in an idyllic, well, hillbillyic community of backwoods people that live away from civilization in trailers out in the forest, but they don't have any illness and they don't have any disease. Well, that's because they sacrifice people whose faces appear in a jug to the creature that lives in a pit that they all worship. So yeah, now complain about your HMO, but I'm not complaining about Jug Face. This is a good horror movie because it, to me, it was about repulsion. Let's just look at Ada, our main character. Now her entire life, she's been part of this community and she only fights the pit when it's her face that shows up on the jug, right? So that means we have an entire life of accepting other people dying for her and for the community. So she really has no noble cause at the beginning of the film and her, well, relationship with her brother, which is very, is well a little repulsive in its own right this film just has so many elements that shouldn't work i mean we have pretty bad nasty rednecks and we've got people's faces appearing in pottery as signs for sacrifice to a demon thing living in a hole in the ground i mean the first time you see the pit it really looks like a hole in the ground. But that's the masterful style of Chad Crawford Kinkle because this hole in the ground becomes the source of terror by how his actors react to it, by how he shoots around it, by the blood and the guts that do happen in the film and how the pit reacts to those, and just how it becomes the center of everything bad and horrifying that goes on in the film. And I gotta tell you, I went from, that's the pit, come on, to, dude, that's the pit, get away from it! And the pit, isn't even the scariest thing in this film. Wait till you see Sean Young as the mother. Creepy. <laughs> and I have to say, Jug Face is a good horror film. It gives us the repulsion of people living with dark supernatural terror. And really, the acting style is great, but it's the characters they want to push you away. But the story, the direction, how this movie comes to life is what's going to pull you back, and you will want to know how this movie ends.